Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video, we're back on the Noob to Pro account. Yeah! So I haven't done Noob to Pro in a while. Big legendary. Anyways, we have an epic card. I don't remember when I got this. Uh, I think I did one dimension off camera or something. But uh, yeah, we can go and replace that card. So uh, yeah, last time I checked, cause I don't know. So we're on Fate Dimension Nightmare, yeah. So uh, yeah. Let's go and do a dimension and hope we get a legendary card. Or at least an epic card. Alright. This is about to be the luckiest anime dimensions moment ever. Oh! Holy mo- That was more lucky than when I win iPhones on random websites. I'm so lucky with that. Ooh, that's a pretty good card, not even gonna lie. So now, which one do we replace? We're gonna replace... Uh, this one. This is a maxed out card. Anyways, there we go. Oh yeah, the team's looking a little bit silly. Let's go and take a look at our stats. Why do we have so much assist skill introduction? Uh, 9 attack, pretty good. 4 cool introduction, 26 crit chance, 61 crit damage. Crit chance and crit damage aren't too bad, but the attack is horrendous. Anyways, let's just keep going. Oh yeah, also we hit level 102, which was a little bit silly. I'm probably going to try to get, like, slightly past 106 today. Probably going to go to 110. But oh uh, yeah, let's go and go to another dimension. Alright. Another legendary? To be honest, I wouldn't be that mad with an accessory either. Alright! Kind of cooking today. Let's see the stats on it. Let's watch it's like perfect stats for an epic. Okay, it's not that bad. Uh, I'm gonna replace this legendary. And there we go. We're kind of climbing up in the world right now. Also, if you didn't realize why I replaced this legendary, it's because this is a level 98 card and this is a level 91. Ooh, the crit damage is a bit low right now. And this is cool introduction. <coughs> oh, that looked weird. I don't know. I'm probably not going to spend traits because Vicious Epic isn't even really that bad. Anyways, I don't know if... Nah, I should definitely keep this because even though the stats on this are better, it's got a thousand less attack on it. Well, 600, but basically the same thing. And that's just going to really help us in damage. Um, we should level up this run too. But uh, yeah, let's go Buster Brown. Level 103. Alright. Alright, we've gotten pretty lucky this episode. Let's keep up the trend. The statistics. All right, that, that kind of. I'm not even gonna leave for that. Um, just gonna retry. All right. Let's not. Let's not make this run be like last run. Or I'm gonna. Mm. Ooh. That. <sighs> Boom. All right. Wow, that looks pretty weird. Anyway. Oh! Holy moly, guacamole! That's what a loser would say. Another legendary card. Damn. Um, and I bet you're wondering how I got here. It all started about 300 years ago. Anyways, I kind of hope this card's got good stats. Um, uh, also three more levels till slime dimension. Okay, 92%. I'm just gonna say two levels. That's pretty mid. I'm definitely gonna get rid of that though. Damn, we ball it. Let me sell these. Um, am I gonna upgrade these? Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Uh, how much is it gonna cost to upgrade? So 300k per upgrade. That's gonna be pretty expensive. I don't know, because we're about to get to Slime Dimension, and that's gonna have some pretty strong cards. Slime Dimensions are pretty uh, decent. <coughs> it's okay. Anyway, Slime Dimension's a pretty decently hard dimension. So I'm probably gonna have to upgrade these. Okay, yeah, that's not... Okay, whoa, calm down on the price there, Bus Buster Brown. Alright. Okay, six foot, that's pretty bad. Uh, I'm not even gonna upgrade this one, it's not even gonna be worth it. Anyways, we could probably complete two, dimension be two dimensions before raid opens, so let's go and do that. Level 104, Buster John. Alright. So, we're two levels away from Pirate, Dim or not Pirate. Whatever, let's go. Mm, it's not that good, Buster Brown. 
Anyways, when I upgraded the legendary cards, it kind of kind of made me destroy the dimension. All right, it kind of made me like slap them around a bit, and they went ow 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 you ow 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 ow. Why did I go back? I didn't get any good cards. All right, one more dimension, then we can do raid. Uh, but what I was trying to say earlier was two levels away from slime dimension. That would be a little bit silly. Uh, if we got this on slime dimension, that would be not a little bit silly. Turbo silly. Alright, there we go. Final boss dead. Still two more levels till slime, but next dimension we should level up. Alright. Alright. If that has good stats, I'll equip it, but it probably doesn't. Ooh, Buster Brown, you really serving me with a good meal today. That could have been better, but it's a it's a pretty good epic card. Let's go ahead and check our stats now. 20 attack, 10 assist cool introduction, good trade-off, 9, 10 cool, whatever. Um, let's see, cool introduction, 8, crit chance, 26, crit damage, 58. So the crit chance and crit damage are about the same but the attack is up real big but oh uh, yeah raids open so let's go ahead and do it i'm probably gonna try and get jotaro i don't know if i should go for garo though because garo has uh the meta assist and that'd be a little bit silly if i had a meta assist and i already have christmas saber so i don't really need jotaro i guess i'll try and get garo all right let's go buster brown Go faster, idiots! God. Alright, so I did 97 million, I can do 100 million, but I died like 400, maybe a uh, quadrillion times, so I only got 97 million. But now I have 190 raid tokens instead of how, however many I had before. No Garo or anything, uh, no accessory from him, no card. Anyways, let's go ahead and get on to the next dimension. Level 105! The boss leveled us up. That's pretty cool, actually. <coughs> boy, oh, oh boy, oh boy. That is big. An epic card and a legendary card. I genuinely screamed. So, <coughs> yeah, the other stat. Ooh, that's a pretty. That's some pretty good stats we got there. Triple legendary cards. Booyah. Oh my god, <laughs> I'm rich. I don't know what to say, I'm rich. I'm rich, fellas. 
Also, I wonder, I wonder how many stat points I have. 17k. So we're missing out on a lot of stuff. Uh, we also got this. Yeah, but I wonder what gem character I'm gonna get next. I'm probably gonna get, probably gonna get Rimuru and awaken her for the assist. Speaking of that, um, let me redeem the codes. So the next code we got is star. Under braid tokens and boosts and gems. And I don't remember what the last... Jesus Christ. Alright, I'm finished getting all the codes. And I now have... 360 raid tokens, oh my god! And 1.6 thousand gems. So, I'm not gonna buy anyone yet. I want you guys to decide in the comments who I'm gonna buy. So, please decide. Because I don't know who. Um, I want to get Remuru because uh, I want to awaken her assist so I can actually have two good assists in, in this video game. Since I'm most likely not- what the fu- Who- whose idea was it to give us 31 more days on Gara Raid? Who? Who decided that? Cool Bulls, was that you? I hate you. He was supposed to be going this update or something or last update, I forgot. He's been out for like two and a half months already, Jesus Christ. Part two. Anyways, we're about to hit 106 and that's going to be pretty- that's gonna be pretty. No, we are not doing hardcore. I hate to break the news to you, Buster Brown. Buster Brown. I'm gonna try and upgrade uh, this card right here because it's not even that bad. You know, it's not. Okay, I was more upgrades than I thought I would get. But now, I wanna see how strong I am in dimensions. Let's go ahead and chickity check this out, home dog. Oh yeah, pretty much one-shotting the mobs now. That's pretty silly and crazy and wild and the the born to be wild baby diapers and why did i say baby diapers i'm really excited for the new anime dimensions update it's coming out in uh, like 10 days which is pretty silly i'm not i'm not I don't know, I don't know. um if it's anything like this update like how much they added in it then it's going to be pretty awesome of an update but one thing i do find strange about this update is uh the leak we got wasn't actually added into the game if you guys remember the crescent slashes i don't know what that is i don't think that was added into the game um it's either going to be added this update or they canceled it um but i hope it does get added because if it does it's probably something to do with kokushiba and he, he's a pretty cool character in this game his effects look nice um he looks cool he's decently hard to get i guess or they might be doing something with, like, time challenge. I don't know, just a wild guess. I've, I've been saying that for the past, like, seven updates. I really want them to do something with time challenge. The game mode's pretty fun, and you get basically no rewards for it besides the stat points. Stat bonuses, actually. Um, and they give you they give you pretty good stats, but you, you only have to go up to 750 on time challenge. And that's so easy, especially since Garo is, like so easy to get and he's the best character for time challenge like by far so it's it's just kind of easy to get 750 nowadays i think they need to raise it to 1000 they also really need to raise the damage stat bonus because it's still it's been at 1.5 billion since villain dimension back then that was actually like pretty hard to do you'd have to actually do a pretty decent chunk of grinding but now if you want 1.5 billion you can literally just sit there for like either a small bit of the raid or just get to level like 90 and you would have completed that task like i'm at 2.5 billion damage right now on this account and i'm level 100 also one thing i do want to talk about is levels so i don't know if there will actually be a, a level 200 i mean probably so because by the end of next dimension we're already going to be at level 190 but there's a pretty high chance well actually not really the game's actually kind of been pretty alive here recently like, it, it was at 10k players not even that long ago. It was, like, at almost 20k this update. And it maintained 15k for, like, a week and a half. But, um, I think within the next year, they'll start, or stop updating. Which means maybe one more? No, maybe at the most, four more dimensions. And at the least, two more dimensions. So, we'll probably barely get past level 200 if they start, up, or stop updating within the next year. But I doubt they'll stop updating within this year. I think they still got another, like, maybe two or three years left. A lot of people don't think so, but Cool Bulls is making a lot of money off Anime Dimensions. Probably. Because a lot of people buy the Robux characters, because, you know, they've been getting pretty good recently. A lot of people buy Raid Tokens, which I feel like that's kind of a waste of money, but... 
a lot of people buy shadow tokens for shadow monitor or his awakening a lot of people buy game passes xp boosts actually no no one no one buys xp boosts i don't think a single person has ever bought a, a uh what's it called gold boost who buys those if you've ever bought a gold boost let me know because i'm genuinely interested i do not think like more than two people have ever bought a gold boost the only boost i've ever bought in or bought in bought in is not a word dumbass the only boost I've ever bought was, uh, XP boost, um, it was a little bit silly. That's when I was trying to get number one on the level leaderboard, even though they were scripted. I made it to top 17, and then I quit the game for a while. Um, but oh uh, yeah, I ended up buying, like, oh, the boss is dead. Okay, I was waiting for it to spawn again. Two common cards. Yes, sir. I'm gonna take a slight bl break. I'm gonna take a slight break, Buster John. I'm back, and it's been four hours. So yeah, I'm ready to do some more Noob 2 Pro. I took a little break, only four hours. But uh, yeah, nice to see three legendaries. That's kind of cool. And let's go ahead and do some Fate Dimension. That's cool. We're going to do Fate, and I think in like two dimensions, we should... Nope, not hardcore. We should hit level 106, which would put us in Slime Dimension, and that would be a little bit turbo. Turbo. There we go. Boss completed. Alright, you know, I wasn't really expecting much. But I think next dimension we should actually hit level 103. What am I talking about? 106. Alright. Oh my god, we're so close to 106. Uh, Okay, that's, that's what we get. So next one, I'm just going to leave as soon as I hit level 106. Um, because I don't really need the rewards here. I, I, I guarantee I was going to drop a 5 out of 5 legendary accessory, but who knows. Alright, here we are. I think after this patch of mobs, we should level up, so I'm just going to use, like, all my moves. Okay, I guess not. This patch of mobs, probably. Yeah, I'd say so. This has more mobs than the last one, so it should give him even more XP, and... Level 106, that's big. Alright, let's just go ahead and go. Alright, here we are. So, now we're 106. We can do slime dimension now. So I'm gonna go I'm gonna go ahead and make one. Wait, before we do that, what are the drops? So we can get primordial and rimmer. So let's just kinda hope we drop rimmer because if we do we can awaken her. I also hope I drop the devil wings because like <laughs> they're pretty good. I'm also gonna go ahead and do speed raid. I guess I'll use my worst characters first. Quadrillion ping montage. Anyways, we're finally finished with that. Got a little bit of rate tokens out of that. Got a fire. 
So if I want, I can also get a Madoka key, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm not even gonna do that. There's a gun saver. How the how do they how do they know what assist I'm using? What? These guys are smart or something. Anyways, let's go and move on to the first slime dimension. Interesting. R rival slash AAT character has a decent well, what am I afraid of? but what the fuck the is am I afraid of? Afraid of me or and these are like love you back. Anime you know, well, chat is just too. so weird. Half the fuck time they don't know it. what they're talking about and sometimes you'll run into an expert. Anyways, I don't know what I'm talking about. So go find someone that knows what they're talking about. We're actually doing way better than I thought we would. Not even gonna lie. Go! Jesus! Stop! I don't know if I put this on hardcore or not. If I did, farewell, fellas. I forgot about this wave of mobs. I don't think I put it on hardcore, though. I think I'm smart, not stupid. I don't think I'm stupid. The pet's gonna activate here. That's gonna be a little bit silly. Now it's gonna activate again. I forgot I'm using an epic pet, and I have Christmas Saber. So, my pet's just always gonna be activating, so. Alright. Let's see how long this boss takes. I think it's gonna take a while, because he can actually, like, dash around. And it's worse than the way... Oh my god. Well, if we're about to figure out if this is hardcore. So, I'm just gonna reset off of all these characters. The reason I reset off these characters is, um, it's, it still saves time, even after resetting this many times. That's just how much faster Christmas Saber is. Then, oh my god, can you stop dashing? Jesus. Jeez, you ass. Anyways, Christmas Saber is just so many fast for dimensions. That's why I always reset off of all my characters. Plus, my assists, they're terrible characters, you know? Nezuko, she's not that bad, but she's not good for dimensions, especially compared to Christmas Saber. Don't ever do that, alright? You can't really even compare any character to Christmas Saber if, I, if you have Divine Pet at least. Also, I made a poll. It got like 5k votes. Um, on who who do you think the strongest anime dimensions character is? And the oh my god, the options were Odin, Shadow Monarch Awakened, Madoka Awakened. Um, what was the last one? I forgot. The uh, oh my god, I'm actually gonna have to check this. Hold on, when I die, I'll check what the last character was. But anyways, the right answer was Odin because. Odin is just the best character if you don't have to find pet. Um, you can get around 120 in dimensions with him and about 9 billion damage in raid. So that makes him better than Shadow Monarch. Even though Shadow Monarch can get a 1 minute solo time, he only does 7.5 billion. So he, he's not really that good. Uh, and Madoka, she does like 8 billion or something like that. Maybe somewhere around the same damage as Shadow Monarch. Did I say Millen? I'm gonna say Madoka. Sorry if I said Millen. Anyways, I'm going to in death. But anyways, the right answer was... Oh yeah, the last one was Christmas Saber. But the right one was Odin. But if you have Divine Pet, so there were two right answers. If you have Divine Pet, it was Christmas Saber. So it was Christmas Saber and Odin. Alright, all you guys were stupid. Like, 80% of you voted not the right answer. Which... Why did you all vote Shadow Monarch? I, d I didn't make a showcase on him, but Spit did, I and I'm assuming you watched it, because I had 10k views. Plus, I was literally live-streaming, testing Shadow Monarch, and he, wa he, he wasn't really that good. Oh my god, calm down. I'm at 500 HP, calm down, Buster Brown. That does- yeah, that rhymes. That's pretty cool. That- that was actually pretty cool, I'm gonna say that a lot more often now. No! Oh my god. Also, I've been wanting to make content on different games canes yeah i've been wanting to buy some different canes for old people here recently anyways um i've been wanting to make videos on anime adventures i mean it works decently well i get like almost a thousand views but it's kind of hard to make content on two different games considering i i record like usually once or twice a day on anime dimensions already besides the past three days ignore those i haven't uploaded in three days but I probably will make videos on Anime Adventures, like, updates and stuff, and stream updates on there. Because Anime Dimensions is kind of running out of content lately. Um, I, I only do my series now, like, all the series, series is, what's the plural for series? I, I think series is the plural, plural, I think series is the plural of series. Maybe. It might be series, but I doubt that. That sounds pretty silly. Anyways. I'm doing multiple, like, uh, Luckiest Drops, uh, Noob to Pro, which, uh, hey, you're watching that. 
uh, and playing on fans' accounts. I do all those, um, and that's pretty much the only content I do except for uh, content from updates. Like every update, I'll do like top seven must-have characters, new character showcase, um, new character showcase again, but with Celestial Tree. Um, sometimes I'll make like a tutorial video, which I'm probably gonna do another beginner guide soon. I'll either do it after next update, slash this update, whatever you want to call it, or I'll do it now, because there's still a little over a week until the next update. And not much will probably change, that's why I don't really make many beginner guides, is because like, nothing really changes. The only thing, well it's actually changed a lot, because the last time I made one was like 10 months ago, but do kind of need to update that. Things have changed a bit, just a bit though. But uh, yeah, I want to make content on anime adventures and the reason i say that is because i kind of like the game not even more. and i it's got a lot of, if i'm being honest it's got a lot of players more more fan base you know but that'll also make it harder to like do those kinds of videos and get popular off of it so that's m mainly the reason why i don't do anime adventures is because it's kind of too hard you know not the game's not hard it's just uh, it's hard to be a YouTuber on there. It's really competitive. Unlike Animated Dimensions, which has been getting more competitive because we've gotten like two new YouTubers that are decently sized. But I'm pretty much at the top right now, so not really, not really a problem. Top for Animated Dimensions, not YouTube, Jesus. Anyways, um, uh, yeah, since the Animated Adventures update, I think is tomorrow, I'll probably stream it, so watch that. I'm also prepared to spend, no, I'm not. I'm not, I'm not prepared for that yet. I will a couple days after the update, sadly. Also, the support was a little bit crazy. I made a community post saying, sorry for not uploading in three days. I'll upload two or three videos today. I didn't. I'm only going to end up uploading one. Maybe two if I have enough time, but let's see what we get. Legendary Guard. Ooh, two epics? That's not bad. That's, it's better than I thought we were going to get. Anyways, let's go ahead and check the stats, Buster Brown. To get that frown away from me, Buster Brown. Let's check uh, the dip. Ooh, 8, 6,000 to 8,000 on this one's max. All right, I'll probably replace... Uh, all these are pretty good. Um, why did I say good like that? I'll probably replace this one. I'll pl yeah, probably that one. That one has no upgrades or anything. Uh, I don't think I'll replace this one, though, because it's got, like, pretty good stats. Um, and it's got a pretty decent amount of upgrades, so. But, uh, yeah, I say that I'll do it for today's video, because, because I said so, stupid. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video, where I shoot spit bubbles, and then one of them becomes a black hole. I don't know how I did that, but it kind of sucked after that. Never mind. Anyways, goodbye.